The concatenate function allows us to join several strings of text together into a single string of text. And to demonstrate how this works, I'm going to use this list of names. What we'll do is join the first name and the last name together to create a full name. So as with any function in Excel, we'll start with the equals. I'm going to start typing concatenate. And as you can see, Excel has kindly brought the function name up for me. I'm going to click on that. And here it's telling us we need to select the text to be used. So we're going to reference cell B3, which is the first name, comma, and then because we're typing a name, we need a space between the first name and the last name. So using double quotation, space, double quotation, that will give us the space between the first name and the last name. We'll then press comma and reference the last name press enter and there we go the two strings of text have been joined together to create a full name which in this case is Jenny Davis once we've done that we can then drag down and use that same formula on the first name and last name for all of them and we join all the names together just to show you quickly as well it's not just text that this can be used with continuing on then with Jenny Davis if we just open up the formula again and continue if I now add another space and then select the age and hit enter as you can see it will also add numbers in as well so any of these now because they're referenced we can change them and it will automatically update whatever has been referenced instead of using the concatenate function we can also use the ampersand symbol which is found on keyboard by pressing shift and seven as you can see the symbol on the screen now so instead of using the concatenate function we would write equals again reference the cell at this time using shift and seven the ampersand symbol double quotation space double quotation ampersand again and then the last name press enter and we have the same result. Again, because the cells are referenced, they will uh, update if we change them. So if I change this, there you go, it automatically updates. And it, again, it would work as well with the, the numbers. All we would have to do is ampersand again, space, ampersand, and the age, enter, and there we go, the numbers come up as well. So that's how you'd use the concatenate function in Excel.